This can't be real. Can you feel the grass? The wind on your face? Can you hear the leaves? Do you smell the dew? You might find it overwhelming. Your kind consider this a place of serenity. Where am I? You are wandering in a memory of the place you call the Ether. The crystals in this cave show the memories they keep. I am the first that was forgotten. The oldest thought and the earliest memory. For godlings left what was once their home, and they long to return. But you have never known anything else. The ether was never yours to remember. I don't understand. What do you want from me? Your kind are always searching for the new, hunting it wherever you see it. What you catch is an illusion, so you search again, never resting. You leave behind an ocean of possessions to be forgotten. Forgetting is easy. As the new arrives, the old departs. Where does it go? Your kind fill a void with impulses of the new. One cannot blame the tree for growing. The tide for rising. But the bird building a nest takes only the twigs it needs. Bonku built masterful creations, in this world and the other. Creations made to last generations. Bonku displayed unique examples of his beautiful handcraft. But the world has moved on. What was he to do? He screamed and he cursed. He clung to a world that no longer valued him or his talent. Bonku formed a wish and disappeared inside it until it became true. One day everyone was truly gone and so was he. As he realized where he was, the thought of going back became all-consuming. He immediately forgot the hardships of the other world. A strange hunger grew in him as he devised a way to return. But his accomplishment will lead 
to his demise. You mean the Ether Bridge? There must be a way to save Bonku. Bonku has planted you here, and your roots are his. You need to make a choice. What choice? know your own story, but these crystals remember. Wait! Don't come back until it's gone. will keep you warm. Someone will find you here. Please forgive me. Don't go. Why are you showing me all of this? Your past is who you are. Why would you give me all this and then take it away?
together is running out. I have so many questions. Where is my mother? The only question you need to ask is, what does your heart desire? Bonko is the closest I have to family. Perhaps I can make him understand. Make him want to stay. I am not sure you can. What do you expect me to do? This is the oldest part of the caves. This is where the world of the Forgotten began. Here stood the Cornerstone, the most concentrated anima crystal in the realm. But it was stolen. Banku, inside the Cornerstone was the heart of this world. The Arca. Bonku ripped it out and split it in two. One for you and one for him. That kept you from crystallizing. He will need both halves of the Arca to power the Ether Bridge. If he succeeds, this world will come to an end. The, the Forgotten Ones and Vic. Our world cannot exist without the Arca. I will go to the tower and speak to Bonku. He will listen to me. Where you belong is a choice you need to make. But you will not have to make it alone. Forgive you.
happen here? Godlings. It's completely destroyed. doing here get out wait this is all your fault he'd never have found us if it wasn't for you no i came here to leave you don't belong here leave us alone get out right now oh Anne, i'm so sorry you don't mean fig not you two. I'm sorry, Fig. Do not say another word. I didn't mean to. You alone are responsible for this enforcer. This is where all your actions have led us. You're right. No, Anne. He's right. It's all my fault. What did you do to him? Put that Arca down. Show some respect, girl. Where is Anne? <gasps> Impossible! Fig? What did you do to me? I don't know. I was gone. I'm so sorry, Fig. I guess a stupid, soulless thing like myself will have to settle for that. I don't believe it! You think I'd leave you in charge, Bob? And what happened after I left? I found a crystal cave. I met a spirit in there, and she changed my Arca somehow. She told me she was the world's first memory. She also told me that if Banku turns on the ether bridge, the world will cease to exist. Well, she met a spirit in a crystal cave. Don't start. She met the caretaker. There's no question about it. It's the only explanation for all of this. The caretaker doesn't exist. A spirit in a cave? A first memory? One who just happened to give Anne the ability to revive Forgotlings? I don't care, but if our Arca can revive distilled Forgotlings, I'm afraid we do need our help. What do you say, Enforcer? Should we set aside our differences? Let's do it. Wonderful. The first thing we need to- I'm joining Fig, not you. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. I have a plan, and as much as I hate to admit it, we need your help, Enforcer. I'm doing this so no Forgotling will ever be distilled or hurt again. I couldn't have put it better myself, then. Fig, why are you staring at me? No reason. There are a lot of distilled Forgotlings outside. I better get to work. When you're done, let's meet in the hall and discuss our plan of attack. Bulb are waiting for you in the hall. We need 
to plan what is ahead. I'm so happy I got to see you again. Me too. I have so many questions, but we never have the time. You already carry all the answers. You're right. I'm not. Thank you. told me what happened here while I was gone. It's a long and sad story. Are you sure you want to hear it? I want to know what happened. It all went very fast. After our talk at the plant, I ran to the service track we used and drove back. I arrived here expecting the worst, but everyone was fine. I was in the middle of delivering my report when I heard an explosion, and Banku himself came through the roof on a mining lift. He was here? In person? Are you sure you want to hear the end of this? Of course. Tell me everything. Well, Banku broke through the roof. Validated forgotlings were everywhere. They set fire to the linen. Before I knew it, everything burned. Banku was distilling everyone that crossed his path. I decided to hide the survivors in the memorial. There. We sat, just waiting for him. And of course, he found us. I got up, and I looked him in the eye. Then he yelled, Where is she? But before I could answer, the light faded around me. No pain, just darkness creeping in from all sides. The next thing I know, the light returned, and there you are. I'm sorry you had to go through that. We have to stop him. We will. <laughs> 